Hi everyone and welcome back. This video is about makeup trends that need to die in 2016. Actually, some of these makeup trends really need to die and they should have never ever ever been a trend. And my eyes are super red and watery and I have a little bit of foundation on. I just couldn't finish the makeup look to do this part of the video so you'll know why in a minute. Now uh, Wayne Goss and Jackie Anna or Anya filmed a video like this not too long ago. I'll put both video links down below so check them out of course after you watch this video. Now if I offended anybody I do apologize it is meant to be a fun video so let's get started and you'll see why my eyes are so red and I'll see you guys soon. Have a fabulous day and don't forget to subscribe. Take care. Bye bye. I'm not getting enough coverage. Yeah, that's better. Now it's covering everything I need it to cover. More is better, more is better, people. Looking good. Yeah, I think that's plenty. Should I add more? No, I think I got it covered. Alrighty then, it is time for some concealer. Just a wee bit. I have so much going on under the eyes. I must cover it all. I just have to blend. That's okay. I have another hour or so. Oh, I need more blending. More blending. I will not smile. I will stay like this so my wrinkles are not accentuated. It's time to contour. Here we go. Under the chin, over here, under here. Let's not forget the nose. We gotta get that nose nice and thin. Oh, why not right here? You know, the key to this beautiful makeup is blending. And if you don't blend, you're gonna look like a clown. Look how thin my nose is. Oh wow, look how skinny my face looks. Is this not amazing or what? I'm just showing you some of the things that I like to do to my face to thin it out. Especially after the holidays, you know, you eat so much and all that fat goes right into your face so you must thin it out. Do I look thin? Bronzing is good to give you that sun glow look like you've been in the sun and you just have a hint of a tan. I love bronzers. They make me look so beautiful, especially the ones that have a lot of shimmer. Don't forget the neck and your chest. Does it look like I got some sun today? You know what, I'm just gonna put it all over the face. I think I wanna make my lips so much bigger. I have thin lips, but I wanna make them bigger as if I just got injections in my lips. I love that look. The bigger, the better. Do you think they're big enough? I think so. Just think of all the money I just saved. Wow. Mm, gorgeous. So hot and sexy. It's time to do some highlighting, also known as strobing. For some reason, highlighting has been rebranded as strobing. I don't know why they came up with that word, but let's just say highlighting. I think we should get rid of the word strobing and keep it as highlighting. So I'm going to do some, not a lot, but a little bit of highlight. Look at that. That's just to lift my cheeks up. Could you see that? Like I said, we don't need to do a lot of highlighting. We just need a little bit. Remember, a little goes a long way. I think I'll do it on my chin. Cupid's bow under my lower lip my forehead and of course down the center of my nose just a little bit and there you have it it is highlighting it's gorgeous it just lifts everything that needs to be lifted even your nose I guess <laughs> but I think it looks amazing it is more than okay to change the shape of your eyebrows you don't want to overdo it but you just want to have slight change and this is how it's done you want to draw a line up and you want to go like this and then go on the bottom a little bit and do the same thing follow the shape of your eyebrows 
and then fill them in just like that. Eyebrows are so important because if they're not done properly, your makeup will not look so good. Look at this. This is what I call the perfect eyebrows. And there you have it. See how gorgeous that is? Now one of my favorite eye looks is the winged eye. You can create so many beautiful looks with just black eyeliner and it's absolutely gorgeous. Just go as long as you can all the way out. The longer it is, the better. And this is how it's done. It makes my eyes so much bigger. See? Do you see that? This is one of my favorite looks. I love smoky eyes, so I'll show you how it's done. You want to start with a lighter color of brown under your lower eyelash because we are making it smoky. And we're not done. Now we're going to add the black. Ooh, poked myself in the eye. You don't want to do that. Oh. This is why I don't have my contacts in because I knew I was going to poke myself in the eye, but it's not a big deal. I love this look. It's so sultry, it's so sexy. Poking myself in the eye again. I'm going to add a little bit of shimmery black. Oh yeah. And here's what the smoky eye looks like. Gorgeous eye look. Look how red my eyes are. I don't know if you can see my red eyes because I poked myself in the eye several times, but that is okay. It's not a big deal. I can always use eye drops. I have them somewhere. I gotta take some of this makeup off. It is actually, I gotta take a lot of this makeup off. It's ridiculous. Thank God for coconut oil. God, I'll be here for days. Oh, I am going to so break out. Talk about a lot of makeup. Oh my gosh, I removed so much makeup and I'm definitely breaking out. I could just feel it on my skin. My eyes are red, everything is red, and I need to go give my skin some TLC.